So, welcome. I'm on my machine of Peter Vess. Snapper is active. And what I'm gonna do is what I told in the other video, 2607. We're already at snapshot number 16. And I'm gonna get my data in. So put your scripts online. There are so many places where you can put your scripts online and it does not cost you a penny. All it requires is some knowledge about cloning and git cloning and all that. That's simple if you watch a few videos. So git clone. And here we have the Arlux Nemesis scripts. This is what I run after every clean install of Arclix because I will not put Spotify on the ISO, but I'll install it later on. And so many other things like WPS Office, which is a great tool to have Word documents or Excel documents opened, but it takes like, I don't know, megabytes. So the ISO will be so much bigger. Look at this size here. 1.2 gigabyte. So things like OneDrive, uh, sorry, Google Drive, InSync is well both actually. It's a tool to uh, synchronize with the cloud. But it's paid. I've paid it. But uh, up to you to decide if you want these things. So they're not going to be on the ISO ever, ever. So afterwards, you uninstall things that Arclix gives, or you install more things that you want that we don't give we don't provide in this case i'm gonna launch virtualbox okay virtualbox sounds like a good thing to install virtualbox is on there and so on right sardi extra icons we have 100 icons of sardi 100 because of scripting the knowledge and the power of scripting but you can also remove stuff what do i remove i'm not on a laptop tlp is gone I don't have Broadcom, Broadcom is gone, I don't have Realtek, gone. And all these drivers are not necessary I'm at this point in time on NVIDIA, running with the driver of NC minus B. I'm using what driver? NVIDIA, right? I don't need anything else but that thing. So all the other guys, I don't need. So this can be your thing as well. If you say, all right, I make my something similar, of course, don't copy paste and think and assume that everything will be okay, right? Use your brain, think, okay, this applies to me or this does not apply to me and change it. But reuse, why not reuse, right? So you see some of the stuff is already gone. Of course, then it says target not found because I'm trying to remove something that's already gone. Eh? But just to be sure that it is gone. It's in there. We're already at snapshot 46. <laughs> Just wanted to show a video about that. It's kicking in always, right? It's always kicking in. And these things are just personal things. They're often not about installing stuff, but about uh, this side here, the, the, the install the personal settings kind of thing. So if, we, if you wanna see, you can. It's just running number 900. And then you see immediately the site. I don't know, not this one, I guess. Ah, 905 is that one. So go and have a look what's in there. So this is what I have on all my machines. All my machines, even though I don't build on them, if I don't have them, but it's, it's there, it's visible. Any of my SSDs will always have that tuner. I know where everything is. I don't waste my time by where was it again right by clicking and clicking you know all the major things are to our, are to the left and i either install them like carly or lc or a or i don't but the bookmarks are there already so otherwise it would be tease to do all these things again and again and again and that's why we make scripts have somebody else do it for us but this is about as well right workflow but as well about snapshots Da, 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 da. Right, and now we have learned a new application in the previous video saying du 
had to be pseudo Eric. Voila. Let's make you way bigger. And I'm going to leave everything as is because when you install it, the way I've shown you in the video, 2606. Some of the things, yeah, that's not my password. Some of the things are already set, like snapper timeline enabled and snapper cleanup. So I'm not going to change anything and we'll see in the coming days, weeks, how everything goes. I've already seen it in the past. Then suddenly you jump from 1 to 10 and from 10 to 15 and 16, 17 and then again a jump. So a few of them will be automatically removed. But what I wanted to prove is the more you install, the bigger the size it will be. And it is correct, right? 9.41, that's the size that I have now. And we started at 8. Actually, 1 gigabyte for the software I like. But don't forget, I've removed some stuff as well, hence uh, it went down again. <laughs> and I can probably remove other things that I say, oh, no, nah, I don't want this, don't want, never use this. Occasionally I use this. I'll reinstall it when I need it, right? But most of the things that I'll see, will I'll, I'll probably keep, right? I'm not seeing anything yet that I would remove. Praga is something I don't use. I can't remove Praga. I'll use Spotify. All right, voila. Okay, that's it. That. Um, another video about ButterFS. You saw the ButterFS DU or disk uh, usage and have fun. Cheers.